I lost my Minecraft world back in 2017, and all I had left was a bunch of maps and diagrams that I spent five years revising and refining. Now come with me as I go on an adventure to get back my Minecraft world and to make it bigger and better than it ever was. This is Boaty Gamer Minecraft. Okay, so we're here and I'm sorry I was out for quite some time. I did some things off camera and off showcase. I finished several villages and we're going to start the journey out there. And our first showcase will start in Fort Nethermore because this video will uh, focus on just the Nethermore, Fort, Fort Nethermore region, and I'll take care of another two regions in two future episodes. And we're here in Fort Nethermore. And the villages we will look at were the villages that were over in this area, as well as a Kalingrad. So let me backtrack the horse a little bit so you know exactly where we are going. And if we take this exit here, and here we are. This is going to be a village of masons, and these bedrocks will eventually become job site blocks for future villages, but of course the job site blocks, we don't have them in the current version of Minecraft because 1.12 but still in the preparation phase. Here we have the airfield and what will eventually be a residential building for the villagers. We just have the bare bones and the rest of the rooms will be filled up after we upgrade to 1.20 and we have here what will become a nether quartz farm or nether quartz mine indoors this is to make sure that we can mine quartz in a way that is renewable and same here with clay This is the place where we're going to come to get clay. That's going to be the train station. And as you can see, we have the railways done. And on to the next village. This is going to be uh, called Paris Market. It's going to be uh, an area for, for trading. Again, this is just bare bones because the job site blocks, well, a lot of the job site blocks don't exist yet. And the small farm is we're gonna we're gonna have a few villager uh, villager farmers, but yeah, not much to show up other than well, the inside of the train station there, although not 
too glorious, not too flashy. But here's a train station. But on to the next village we go. So this is the village of Akalingrad. I'm going to put the horse in its pen and here we are. I don't yet know what I'm going to do with this part right here, but oh, this is going to be a village for him. Uh, trading and what makes it special is that we have a mineshaft and end portal closely communicated with it all by railway so it's all by the railway station and the end portal and yeah that's Part of what I've been up to recently and well I'm going to end this episode here this isn't the end of the tour I will upload more episodes soon